between Conor McGregor and Jorge Game Bread Masvidal. All right, so here he is, Jorge Game Bread Masvidal turned pro in mixed martial arts back. Up of strikers, any chance this thing hits the canvas? I don't believe so. I think when you have two high-level strikers like you have in these two men, they're going to go to the center of the octagon, and it's going to be a kickboxing match. A kickboxing match that you would see in a ring. Tonight, you get to watch it inside of an octagon. You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most skipped on all of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, big head kick there. Big ball from West Lance. Now he gets back to range. Oh, straight right. Well, for years, Tyron Woodley had said Jorge Masvidal is the best boxer on this UFC roster. Certainly showed you the hands there. I mean, he's showing it, man. I mean, it's, I mean, he's showing it, John. This guy has the ability to stand and box with anyone in the UFC. And that was on full display when he beat Nate Diaz. He was throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Conor McGregor. And they separate. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great. great. The best head kicks you'll ever see. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, big left hook there. That knee, knee lands there. That knee hurt him. Whoa! after the huge knockout turned in tonight. All right, let's go inside the octagon now. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliano calls a stop to this contest at four minutes, 43 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout. 